The first step was to cut off the steam line to the turbine. The residual energy would be measured until the turbine stopped. Simultaneously, the power in the reactor was reduced to less than 10% of its capacity. Its emergency core cooling, power regulation and automatic shutdown systems were closed down. At this stage, the technicians were operating in the dark. Computer printouts would soon indicate that the reactor was overheating, but the technicians pressed on. To raise the power, the control rods were withdrawn, causing the temperature in the reactor to rise. When the operators attempted to reinsert the control rods, they sparked a massive power surge. Fires broke out. When burning fuel met cooling water, it triggered three massive explosions which ripped off the roof of the reactor. <laughs> 